Good evening. Well, this marks the Penguins second trip to the White House in the past eight years. 2009, of course, as President Obama was starting his first year in office and then today as he closes out his second term. The president today joking with the team, saying that back then his hair color matched the puck more than it does the ice, perhaps as it does now, and also saying that back then Sid really was a kid. Let's give it up for the Pittsburgh Penguins. America's 44th president saluting the Penguins in their fourth Stanley Cup. Welcome to the White House, and we are here to celebrate an extraordinary achievement. Phil Kessel is a Stanley Cup champion. Hey. President Obama making mention of Mayor Bill Peduto, three of the Penn's top performers, and a new Steel City delicacy. Uh, the HBK line, none of whom were on the team last year, were so dominant that they earned their own sandwich at Bramante uh, Brothers. Let's go, Penn. Let's go. Let's go, Penn. The team presenting a jersey to the president, just like they did eight years ago. You know, having done this a second time here, uh, it doesn't get old. It's a pretty unique experience. But not one of a kind for the Penguins, who hope to return yet again next year. One of the privileges when you win the Stanley Cup uh, like we have to have the opportunity to visit the White House is a thrill. All right, and we've got a lot more on the Penn's historic visit to the White House coming up at 6 o'clock, including why Matt Cullen told me his kids weren't all that impressed, actually. That and much more at 6. For now, in Washington, D.C., at the White House, Bo Berman, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.